Hey guys, Xdevine here, and today we're going to be viewing the Greenville Private Server Commands, uh, 2023 edition. Uh, so yeah, um, let's start with the weather commands. Uh, to activate the command bar, uh, you click on the equals, the equals button on, on your keyboard, which also has the plus on it, and there you go, and you got your command bar. Uh, and so there are three types of weathers. Uh, the first one, you have sunny, cloudy, and overcast. Let's start with the first one. So you would type in weather, sunny. And that would t uh, I'm pretty sure it's already on sunny, and then it would take a little while to switch, not too long, and then it would switch. Uh, I'm already on sunny, so it won't work. Uh, so now let's do weather, cloudy. Uh, the weather is currently changing. Please try again in 20 seconds. Uh, that error will pop up pretty often. Okay, uh, let's, let's, wait, is it changing to foggy? Weather, cloudy. And now it will be changing to cloudy. Uh, I can even see the clouds moving. They're generating clouds, so that's pretty cool. Not realistic, but, um, I mean, at least you get cloudy. So yeah, there are a lot of clouds right now. Um, so yeah, this is cloudy. And then last but not least, we have overcast. And overcast is now generating. And this is overcast, like foggy weather. Uh, and so, yeah, that is it for the weather commands. And now let's move on to the next commands. All right. So our next commands will be the announcement commands, which are used in roleplay servers basically all the time. So, for example, if I want to just do a message that says, uh, let's say uh, that Gary's is open, I would type in M, which stands for message, and just write, Gary's is now open. And then you get this little message that pops up up here. Um, and our next one is alert. So for alert, all you have to do is go back to the command bar, but instead of writing message, which is M, type in A, which is for alert. Uh, let's just say um, volcanic eruption. I don't know how to spell that really, but there. Uh, and you got these alert thingies. And yeah. And then our last announcement command is the high alert command. Which you simply just type in HA for high alert. Uh, let's just say subscribe. And now it's red. The little stripe is red. Because it's a high alert. Uh, and so yeah, that would be it for the announcement commands. And now, let's move on to the next commands. Alright, so now let's move on to our time commands. So before you switch the time, which I'll show you how, uh, it might ask you to unlock the time commands. Um, and so if that pops up, just type in time. Uh, it's not popping up for me right now because I have already done that. But if it, if, if it asks you to unlock them, just type in time. And so now, if you would like to change the time, it's based on a 24-hour basis. So if I want to change it to 1 a.m., I would do time 1. Or if I want to do, for example, let's say um, 11, 11 p.m., I would do time 23. And time 20 would be 8 p.m. Uh, I'm not good at uh, 24 hours, so uh, don't judge me. Um, so yeah, I'm not, but I do know that if you do time 13, it would be 1 p.m. Uh, and so yeah, uh, and if you would like to freeze the time, which uh, some roleplay servers do, you would go to the, oh wait, wrong, that's the chat. Uh, you'd go into the command bar and type time freeze. And, and the message would pop up, which says, which says the in-game clock has been paused. So now it's paused at 1.10 p.m. And if you would like to unfreeze the time, you would just simply t 
type in time unfreeze. And now the in-game clock has been resumed. And so yeah, and now let's move on to our next commands. And so let's move on to our next command, which happens to be the teleporting commands, like teleport, bring, and to. Uh, so for example, if I'm just gonna teleport to myself, I'm the only one in this server. So you're gonna write teleport and then a username to the other username. Uh, a little bit, my username is a little bit complex. So you're gonna write uh, the, uh, a player to a player and boom. So I teleported to myself. Uh, yeah, I can't like, you kind of see a difference. I moved a bit forward. And our next command is bring, which uh, in Z series actually showed him teleporting through walls with this command. Like if you're, there's an unclaimed house, you can actually go inside of it by using the bring command. And boom, teleported through a wall. Uh, and so yeah, uh, and if you are in an unclaimed house and you can't exit or anything, you would use the to command. I keep opening up the chat, I'm so used to that. Okay, so you would type in to and then the player. And boom, I am now outside. Uh, and yeah, and let's move on to our next commands. And so our second to last command is the name tags command. So uh, you go into the, uh, the command bar and type in n tags. Uh, it won't work if you just uh, if you're just like outside just walking like this. You have to spawn a vehicle and then go inside of it. And there now you can see name tags and you can see other players name tags as well. And so that brings us to our final command. And so our final command is the kick command, which is often used in roleplay servers when people are not following the rules. Uh, so for this command, you can kick everyone by using kick all, or you can kick a certain player. So I'm just going to kick myself out. And boom, I have been kicked out of the server. And so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys and Xdevon out.